hello guys this is pbn again and today in my tutorial i'm going to show you how to install android kitkat that's 4.4.4 on samsung galaxy s yes, s5830 and to tell you this is the most smoothest working android kitkat rom that i could find for samsung galaxy s yes, and i have provided the roms link in the description below uh, so obviously to do this you need to have your samsung galaxy is rooted and you need to have any custom recovery like clock up mode on it so first of all let's boot it into recovery mode by holding home button and power buttons simultaneously you hold them simultaneously so that it will boot into recovery mode and uh, also before you install any rom it's highly recommended that you have a backup of your previous rom so that if anything goes wrong you can change back to it and uh, please download the rom and have it in your sd card now when it has booted into your recovery mode go to wipe data or factory reset here you should navigate using volume buttons and to click you need to use home button because touch does not work in recovery mode go to wipe data or factory reset and yes when that's done go to wipe cache partition and wipe it then go to mounts and storage and format almost everything except your SD card format your cache format data and also format system be careful that you will not format your SD card if you do your ROM will be gone so when that's done go to advanced and just wipe Dalby cache and battery stats with battery stats also and also make sure when you do this your galaxy s is at least uh, 80 to 90 percent rooted i'm sorry 80 to 90 percent charged because you need not want your galaxy s to switch off when you're installing the rom so it must be at least 80 to 90 percent charged now when all of these things are done go to install zip from sd card and choose zip from sd card now my rom is in bluetooth folder you must know where it's placed in your sd card go navigate to that place see here it is cm11 this is the rom go and hit install so it will take up uh, pretty much of a long time to install till then I'll pause this video so as the installation is over as you can see it says install from SD complete so the ROM is installed successfully now go back and hit reboot system now yeah and now Android KitKat ROM has been installed successfully and now it will boot up as I said, this is the smoothest Android KitKat experience I have ever found for Galaxy Ace. As you can see, the UI, everything is almost very great. There are no lags, no frame drops at all. So, it works pretty well. And yeah, if you have installed it, you'll see the screen. The Cyanogen Mod logo. It's CM11 for Android KitKat. Yeah, now for the first boot, will uh, definitely take a bit longer because all the caches are generated during this time so it will take uh, about four to five minutes till then once again i'll pause the video in order to make it shorter so that even you need not wait so guys after about four and a half minutes the phone has finally booted up as you can see the new ui looks really awesome it's really smooth there's no lags as i i told you before it just looks great the new screen you can see completely different status bar here animations are also good of course it's android kitkat there are no frame drops there are no lags at all it's working really good the ui is also wonderful yeah to show you it's android kitkat go for settings and about phone there 
yes android version 4.4.4 see it's genuine kitkat rom and yeah do enjoy enjoy the kitkat experience on your very favorite samsung galaxy s so for today that's it guys for more cool new videos do subscribe to my channel leave a comment below if you have any doubts and yeah thank you